Antibiotic prophylaxis is the use of antibiotic in order to prevent bacterial infection. Because of the emergence of bacterial resistance and antibiotic toxicity, the indications for using this antibiotic as a prophylaxis is limited to certain conditions such as before surgery, before any dental procedure and medical conditions such as recurrent urinary tract infection. In dental procedure, it is recommended in order to prevent infective bacterial endocarditis. So, coming to the surgery where we use the maximum as a prophylaxis antibiotics. So, the commonly used antibiotic are cephalosporins first and second generation which include cefasolin 1 gram, cefiroxim 1.5 gram is used and only one dose is recommended and the duration how long you will give and the time of administering the antibiotic is very important. Ideally, it is recommended 30 minutes before surgery. Only one dose is recommended in case if the surgery extends beyond the expected time of more than two and a half to three hours, one more dose is recommended. Post operatively, the antibiotic should not be continued unless it is recommended because of any infection or prior colonization, it is recommended. So, commonly used antibiotics are for, or for example, orthopedics, it is first and second generation cephalosporin. In case of elementary canal surgery, for example, appendicitis, we know the flora involved, intestinal flora involved gram positive, gram negative organism and anaerobic organism. So, in order to cover all this flora, it is recommended to give apart from that, give either quinolones can be given or anaerobic coverage metronidazole or clindamycin is recommended. So, we at Apollo Hospital, we strictly follow antibiotic prophylaxis. We do regular monitoring of antibiotic uh, prophylaxis and we do an audit and whatever results are communicated to the respective stakeholders. So, to summarize, in order to prevent antibiotic emergence of antibiotic resistance and the toxicity of antibiotic and the cost involved, it is very important to restrict the use of antibiotics. Thank you.